does have something to share with you guys. <clears throat> well, yesterday, he and I came up with, he is going to give back this holiday season. Come on, tell him what you're going to do to give back. Ezra, I need you to get in the camera and let them know what you're going to do. Look at that cute squirrel. Ezra, tell them what you're going to do to give back. What are you going to do? Uh, to give back my tablet? No. 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 What? You're going to give oh, yeah. back. Come on. But the toys? He's thinking about himself. Now, we're, I'm talking about... Do you know? I don't know, guys. What's up, guys? We're right back with another video. What he said, but guess what we are doing? What are we doing? We're gonna prank mommy. <laughs> we're gonna, we're thinking about a prank to do on her, but right now Ezra and I are walking. We're taking a little walk to where? Publix. Yeah, you know. Might as well get out and enjoy these cool days South Florida's having. For some reason, the weather's been pretty nice, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Ezra is on, you're on break, right? Holiday break? Yeah. Started today. They get a week off for the Thanksgiving holiday. Yes. <sighs> so we're all here just enjoying the stroll. So now back to come on, give me some prank ideas. That's right. Know. What? You said, let me see. You said you had a guess. You're thinking about one. Wait. Oh, I got a good one. What Maybe is it? We can prank mommy that, like her car broke down. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. And how would that be? Hi guys. There's um, our neighbors. Your little friends were in there. Say hi. Mm-hmm. Ezra says we can prank her about the car. Y'all, she would kill us. I, okay, I don't know. I don't and know. how are we going to <coughs> tell her about the car? How are we going to do that? Hmm. Huh? I don't know either. I don't know. <laughs> it has to be something that. very, very simple for Kim. Because she knows. Huh? She knows. Sometimes she's really comfortable. Really so we have to be very sneaky. But it's the holiday season, guys. So anything could happen, right, Ezra? Yeah. Oh, look at our shadows. Y'all see our shadows? That is crazy. We're hoping to see some birds up here. Yeah. We got to cross the street because there's a lot of birds over there. Let's mm -hmm. cross. Right. So, guys, how is the coronavirus in where y'all is? Because... Our numbers have went back up. You see, we got these masks on walking to the store. Plus, you got to wear a mask in the store. But we're wearing it just in case you come in contact by anybody while walking. You want to make sure that you are covering up your mouth. You're staying six feet away. It's really important that you do. I mean, I feel like this is not going to leave. We're almost at a whole nother year. So we've almost been dealing with the coronavirus for a whole year. You want to tell me something? A whole month? A whole year. Oh. Oh, I'm thinking about other people right now. What are you gonna do? Like give back toys, like. From you're going to donate. Donate. And um, you're gonna have you're gonna start a campaign to have other people oh, donate. Yeah. Toys to give back to what? Um, other children. In and the, where? In the foster care. Yes. So he's gonna start a little campaign, and hopefully. Work. be able to donate a thousand toys to you know foster before, before, christmas, before christmas yes yeah you know this is new so he's he's gonna i'll be his first time doing something like this guys but i really think that anyone with kids should always you know have let their kids be involved in something and i thought this was quite you know close to his heart since he comes from being in and out of foster care too so for him to give a child a toy who may not have gotten a toy on the holidays, you know, and try to raise, you know, not raise money, but, you know, just kind of campaigning to see if he can get people to donate a toy. Um, regardless, if he doesn't do that, he does have a lot of toys where he is going to definitely give back to foster care. And he's also going to help out the homeless this holiday season too, right? Yeah. Come on. You want to say anything positive message? We got company, be someone behind us, so hopefully they might want to pass us by because we ain't walking that fast. Come on, what you want to say? Uh, Look in the camera, tell them something. Uh, what do you tell them? Why you why you want to do that? Uh, to help out children. 
Tell them to speak from your heart, honey. Uh, Don't speak like the script. Say what you want to say. Uh, to help our children in the foster care. Say it like you mean it. Yeah. And that's what you want to do, right? Yeah. And why do you want to do it? Uh, to help out kids. But you, yeah, oh. so you want to help them out, but why do you want to help them out? Uh, Tell them about sometimes when you're in foster care, sometimes the kids don't always have, like you know, like a, a lot of toys or even have, come on, stand aside so she can get ahead of us. Right here, okay? Keep talking. Uh, I have toys oh. and, yeah. hmm? and a lot of stuff, baby. Well, pretty much we're just doing toys. Um, Ezra is getting... Good morning. Good morning. He needs to be a better speaker because he's not speaking that great. But he's, he's definitely trying, guys. He just, like, I'm trying to teach him that he has to be very sympathetic to others. And he has to also remember that not everybody in the world has those luxuries that he may have or that other kids may have. So it's very important to give back, to do his part, to do our part, um, and just to live and be very humble. It's, le it's a learning lesson, and that's for for all of us, and for definitely people with kids, because that's not their first, second, or third nature that needs to be taught. And I'm not saying all kids are not like that. Some kids aren't definitely like that, but there's a lot of kids that aren't. So this is just lessons that he's learning, right? Yeah. And it's going to turn you into what kind of a young man? A uh, nice young man? Or yes, a nice and caring young man. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Who does things for what? For Kids. And for others. And for others. Right. Yes. So guys, I think I'm going to stop on that topic. You get the point. You get the gist of what I'm saying, what I'm saying. Um, we're going to continue this little stroll. We'll come back on the vlog in a little bit once we get a little close to our destination. Mm -hmm. And, um, Hi, Mama. all right. Yeah. Florida doesn't have that many trees, they have a lot more palm trees. Oh, and Mama, hmm? you can get like the, 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 the like yellow cases, like the yellow cases, and then you know that those things... What kind of case are you talking about? Well, so you can slide those things off in your thing. Oh, so the, the covers? Off. Yeah, but if you don't want to slide it off, you, you can, don't have to? Yeah, but it can stay on, you want it, and then it will be like, you have to find the body kind of thing. It will work too. Oh. You can take it off and put it back on if you want to. Yeah. So that looks like it could be fun, yeah? Wait, and this one tie his freaking shoe. Oh, God, that sun now. Come on. Yeah, so like I was saying, what's going on, guys? We are back. We are in the store. I just pushing the car. Look at these cookies, y'all. Ooh, love me some of these holiday cookies right here. These ones. Oh, we gotta go down here to get the bread. Woo! This is a, they cannot do this to me. I'm trying to lose the weight, y'all. Putting cookies there. Oh, yep. Yeah. We got to get the uh, green bread that says large. We might as well go ahead and get two loads of those. Right here. Grab them. Now, remember, we're walking, so we can't get too much. Get two of them. Put them in the front. He's just throwing them in the front, y'all. 
We gotta be gentle with bread. Now we gotta go out this way so we can go get the bird seeds over there. Oh, you gotta go. We might as well go get my first. Come on, let's go this way. Huh? The thing she likes to eat. It's called a flying saucer or elephant ear. Come on. Come on. Oh, traffic jam. Sorry, that's okay. Come on, Ezra. Oh, come on. I'm sorry. See this? Hey. Huh. We're going this way. Come on, you get in front of me so I can see you. <laughs> Oops, excuse us, sir. Sorry about that. Ezra's cutting people off up in the store, yeah. Stand behind that guy. Come this way and stand behind that guy. People in stand when you walk like that, when you talk like that. They don't have the cookies anymore. Guess why they don't? Coronavirus. Because of the what? Say it how they say it on, on TikTok. Coronavirus. <laughs> no, say it. <laughs> he he would say it a little bit better, but he's acting brand new right now, y'all. What are you gonna get? You want a bagel for breakfast, or you want to wait to get home and eat some cereal or something? Yeah. Ooh, mommy likes these too. I wonder if she likes these better. It's an almond bear claw. Look at it. Should we get these instead? Yeah. You think she? I think she likes these ones better, y'all. We're gonna give her a little treat this morning. She'll love it. Here, put this, and plus, we don't have to wait because these foods is taking too long. Get on this way. I'm looking for these. You guys ever like these little pretzel thins? See this right here? Well, when we were in Minnesota, my sister, she had these ones that were mustard, y'all, and they were so good. They don't have them here in Florida. I went to two stores, Target and now Publix, and they don't have them. Whatever, come on. Guess we're gonna have to wait to get back to Minnesota to get some of them. And I do like the hot pickles here, but you know what? I'm gonna, I don't see any. Man, Publix is, it's, it's busy already. Oh wait, what do we need now, Ezra? Bird seeds. Bird seeds, yes. How about we stop, let me look at this arugula real quick. Stay right here so I can see. I'm gonna look at this arugula in just a second. I wanna see if it's on sale. I can't really tell yet, but I'm about to see. Hold on, Ezra. Oh, look here. Arugula is on sale, two for five, two for five. Hey, hey. This is my, I guess I'm be carrying a lot of stuff. We got Ezra's backpack though, but I'm about to fill that backpack up and I'll be carrying that backpack home. So I don't know if we're gonna do much vlogging on the way home because our hands are gonna be really full. So we're probably gonna just end this vlog up in the store. Um, come on. We'll go get a couple of more things we need. And guys, thank you very much for hanging out with Ezra and I today in this vlog. We're just having a little morning outing. And you know what, catch us on the flip side. We out.